Commentary throughout this video refers to Oak Creek Homes. In addition, all of the included information pertains to homes built under the Platinum Homes brand name. Thank you for selecting an Oak Creek home. We stand behind our homes and know that you will enjoy your new home for years to come. You are about to participate in the construction of your new home. Construction begins in a controlled factory environment and doesn't end until installation and initial service adjustments are complete. It is important to note that the manufacturer, retailer, and you, the owner, participate in the construction and installation of your new home. Working together, your home will meet our standards for beauty, quality, and long-lasting value. You may be wondering, when will my new home be ready to move into? During the process of building and moving into any new home, the unexpected can occur and result in construction delays. In the next few minutes, we hope to prepare you for the delivery, installation, and ownership of your new home. Prior to viewing this video, your retailer should have handed you the video script. You will be asked to sign the script. Your signature tells us that you have viewed and understand the contents of this video. You will also receive a copy of the video and script to take home. Now, let's step through a few requirements for your construction site. The location you select for your new home can have a great impact on the maintenance requirements and life of your home. The home site should not be in a marshy, unstable, or low-lying area. You should meet with your retailer to discuss the site, site preparation, and construction including utilities, foundation, and any other construction prior to initial closing, as they will affect your total loan amount. Site preparation, drainage, and foundation work will be completed according to federal and state requirements by Oak Creek prior to the delivery of the home to your site. You will be asked to sign a construction worksheet describing the nature of the work and the associated costs. This worksheet will be approved by your lender. Any changes to the construction worksheet will require a change order and must also be approved by your lender. In some cases, delivery to a construction site may present problems and result in delays. Be sure to provide information in advance to your retailer concerning all possible obstacles and hazards such as fences, power poles, trees, narrow roads, bridges and ditches, tight corners, low power lines, or railroad crossings. Will it be necessary to cross a neighbor's property? If so, you should obtain written permission from them to do so. Careful consideration should be given to the placement of utilities, so there is ample room to deliver the home and place it on your site. Utilities of concern should include water, gas, electric, and septic systems. You are responsible for all additional costs associated with the access to your site, including moving obstacles, special equipment, building permits, compliance with local zoning ordinances, and any damage caused to your land as well as your neighbor's land. If your site is difficult to access, let your retailer know in advance. If there will be additional charges, it is best to make preparations before delivery. During the closing process, many documents are approved. After signing all loan documents, they are sent to your mortgage company for review. Construction on your site cannot begin and the home cannot be released for delivery by your mortgage lender until all loan conditions have been approved. If your home is a special order and will be delivered direct from one of our factories, your home order will be initiated at the factory after closing has taken place and all documents have been approved by your lender. So, please allow additional time for the home to be fabricated. Your retailer can give you an estimate concerning shipment from the factory. We will do our best to meet our estimated ship date. When your mortgage company releases the home for delivery and the factory construction process is completed, the delivery contractor will contact you to schedule delivery. It is not uncommon to experience unforeseen delays in construction, delivery, and installation. In many cases, crews are scheduled 10 days in advance. Adverse weather can also delay delivery of the home. For example, our homes are quite heavy and cannot be moved over a rain-saturated site. After your home is delivered to your home site, exterior installation is scheduled and normally takes place in two to four days. The installation manual provides detailed information concerning installation requirements and is used by the installer during the installation process. 
In some cases, another approved document may be used. Exterior installation includes the following steps. The home is moved into position. The home is then set and leveled. Our installation manual requires piers correctly sized and positioned under the home. Most manufactured home installations place piers and base pads on the ground at the prepared construction site. Concrete runners can reduce the effects of ground shifting and settling and are often a suggested option for heavier homes over 1,500 square feet or for homes containing a great amount of tape and textured sheetrock. However, concrete runners do not guarantee a home free of shifting and settling. Special consideration must be given to any pier that is higher than 48 inches. If you suspect your home may exceed this height at any point, notify your retailer as there may be an additional cost. If you've purchased a modular home, your foundation will be designed and approved by a licensed engineer and will be constructed on site and inspected by a third party. Depending on the type of foundation being placed under your home, construction may take longer and delays may be experienced. Note that multi-section homes require one section to be leveled and then sections are joined. The home is then leveled. In multi-section homes, crossover connections between the sections are made, which may include heating and air ducting, electrical, hot and cold water, and wastewater. Due to federal and state requirements, only Oak Creek licensed contractors can provide utility connections. A multi-section home may require trim or siding to be applied and painted at each end of the home. The installer will also complete various items as required for exterior installation, such as shingles, exterior lights, fireplace stack, and furnace cap installation. Exterior doors should function and lock at this time. If plastic was placed on the roof to protect shingles during transport, the installer must remove the plastic and seal any nail holes with approved roof sealant. This practice is acceptable by our shingle manufacturer and does not affect the warranty. Wheels and axles used to transport your home will be removed by the installer. They are provided only for transportation to your site. After the home is set on your site and the exterior is finished, your mortgage company may require a personal interview to confirm delivery. Keys will be released to you when the home installation is 100% complete and the third party inspection has been performed. In transactions involving real estate, your keys will be released to you when all phases of the home construction have been completed and inspected. The interior trim and finish operation varies greatly depending on which home you've selected. Single section homes usually do not require an interior trim and finish operation. In multi-section homes, the interior trim and finish operation usually takes place within 10 business days after the exterior installation is completed and notification of utilities being turned on. Interior trim and finish may take up to five or more days to complete, depending on the extent of finishing required. Some multi-section homes are delivered with carpet already installed and only a seam is required where the sections of the home are joined. Other homes arrive with the carpet shipped loose. Carpet installation will begin after all other interior trim and finish requirements are complete. Tape and texture is brittle material. It is not uncommon for a home containing tape and texture to arrive with cracks. Do not be alarmed as they do not indicate a structural problem of any kind. It is standard procedure to repair these cracks one time during initial factory service. During this service visit, which takes place after the interior trim and finish work and carpet installation, a factory representative will walk the home with you. You and the representative will make a checklist of any cosmetic items, including tape and texture cracks, doors and windows, and any other items in the home needing adjustment. Once the walkthrough is complete, your factory finish team will immediately address each and every concern. Once all work is completed to your satisfaction, you will sign off on all work before the finish team leaves the job site. By addressing your concerns and cosmetic service requests prior to move-in, we can attain the highest level of satisfaction for you. Please note that this service visit will be your one and only cosmetic visit, so be sure to be thorough during the walkthrough. If subsequent cracks occur due to settling, it is a homeowner responsibility. Texture variation does occur in manufacturing and site finished processes. Although applications vary, 
retail model homes can be used as a point of reference for factory specification and workmanship tolerances of wall and ceiling finishes. Utility connections are made after exterior installation is complete. All utility permits and fees must be obtained prior to work being performed. Due to federal and state requirements, only Oak Creek qualified and state licensed contractors can provide utility connections. In many cases where television and telephone outlets are provided, a cable is located directly below each outlet. This way your local provider can connect them conveniently in the direction of the incoming line. Do not turn the power on to your hot water heater until it is filled with water. The heating element will burn out if this is not done and is not covered by the manufacturer's warranty. Some homes contain a red wall switch that controls the power to the water heater. Be sure this switch is in the on position after your water heater is filled with water. If your home contains a red switch, it is most often located in the utility room. When installing your clothes dryer, be sure to route the dryer vent to the exterior of the home. At no time should dryer exhaust be permitted to flow under your home. Please note that a four-prong dryer plug is required. If your dryer contains a three-prong plug, it must be replaced with a four-prong plug, which is available at most appliance stores. If you are installing an evaporative cooler, do not connect it to insulated floor ducting. If you have any questions, please contact your retailer. Your retailer will make every attempt to deliver your home by the requested date, but cannot make specific commitments to delivery or completion dates due to unpredictability of weather, availability of contractors, and other factors. Your home is not ready for move-in until all the preceding steps are complete. Each home is inspected by a third-party engineering firm. This inspection must be performed prior to you taking occupancy or moving your possessions into the home. If you have invested in a tape and textured home, it may take longer depending on the drying time of the texture and contractor availability. It's important to note that in a real estate transaction, occupancy cannot take place until the final inspection of the home and modification of your loan has been performed. Neither your retailer nor manufacturer is responsible for costs associated with delays. It's important to talk about your safety during construction. This will be an exciting time for you. Your home will be nearing completion and you'll be anxious to move in. You'll also be excited about showing your new home to your friends and family. As much as we'd like you to be able to do this, we ask that you limit your visits to the home to times when we've set appointments for you for inspections or other meetings. While it may not look like it, your construction site is a dangerous place. Not just for you, but for your children too. There are loose nails, screws, and staples that can easily go through sandals or shoes. There are also items that could fall on you, causing additional injuries. For your safety, please, only visit your home site when we're there. We believe the surest path to long-term satisfaction is through preventative maintenance procedures explained in your owner's manual. Please read and carefully follow all instructions contained in the manual. Following are a few important owner maintenance responsibilities. Your home will be leveled one time during the construction process. Because we cannot predict how much settling and shifting will occur at your site, neither your retailer nor manufacturer are responsible for re-leveling or performing adjustments related to the re-leveling of your home. As a result of shifting or settling, some cosmetic cracking can occur in ceilings and walls. Shifting and settling may also affect window or door operation, cause cracks and caulking, minor floor squeaks, or minor wall separations. These natural occurrences are the result of settling and are not covered by your warranty. You can minimize the effects of settling through proper maintenance of your home. Have the level of your home checked seasonally and adjusted if necessary. Also, excessive humidity generated inside the home can result from cooking, showering, laundering, clothes drying, and watering of plants or flowers. During periods of high indoor humidity, we recommend slightly opening a few windows to allow the moisture to escape. Hardboard siding should be caulked and painted periodically to prevent exposure to water damage. Make it a point to periodically caulk windows, doors, exterior lights, receptacles, and roof vents. If you purchased vinyl siding, it may look a bit wavy at times. This is due to changes in temperature and is not a defect. Also, exposed plumbing and faucets failing due to normal wear and tear 
are considered homeowner's maintenance. Please check your homeowner's guide for all maintenance requirements. Our homes are built using approved construction techniques. The standards to which we build and service our homes can be seen in the display models at our retail sales centers. We intend to provide the best possible response and quality service. During the first 12 months of home ownership, your retailer will respond to concerns relating to the installation of the home, including stairs, skirting, air conditioners, and other features added to your home during installation. Also during the same first 12 months of home ownership, the manufacturer is responsible for providing service covered by your manufacturer's one-year warranty. Any service request in the first year must be in writing. It also cannot be overstressed that the factory will be best positioned to diagnose and solve any problem if the service request is accompanied by digital photographs sent via email. With regards to home construction, staples are commonly used during construction. Small holes or indentions may be visible in wall panels, molding, or cabinets. Staples may also be visible at the outer edge of carpeted areas and the carpet seam may be visible where multi-section homes are joined. These items are not defects as they are considered normal construction techniques. If factory adjustments are required or if your home arrives with defects relating to finish or appearance, you'll have one opportunity to request this service during your factory finish walkthrough. It is important to note that while factory warranty covers substantial defects in materials and workmanship, coverage does not include furniture, window treatments, or blinds. Items subject to daily wear and tear, such as floor coverings, cabinets, trim, sinks, tubs, showers, faucets, doors, and wall coverings are not covered by the warranty concerning finish or appearance. At closing, your retailer will give you a satisfaction checklist, which is located in your owner's packet. Complete the satisfaction checklist in the home during your walkthrough with your factory finish representative. Your checklist will be addressed and you will be asked to sign off on all cosmetic work completed prior to move-in. We take emergencies very seriously. If you experience a water leak that may cause immediate damage to your home, shut off the water supply and call your retailer immediately. If you experience an electrical problem during your warranty period and are sure there is power to the home, check the panel box and make sure the breakers are in proper position. Second. Check the GFI receptacle. Is the reset button depressed? If after checking the above items, the problem is not corrected, turn off the suspect breaker and contact your retailer. If your retailer cannot be reached, contact your factory service center. We most often respond to emergencies within 24 hours. The appliances in your home are initially covered by their own warranties. If you experience a problem with your furnace, stove, refrigerator, dishwasher, or water heater, particularly in the first 12 months of home ownership, please contact the appliance manufacturer directly. Following your initial 12 months of home ownership, beginning with the first day of the second year of home ownership, your new home is covered by the limited extended service contract for an additional six years of home ownership. Though it is a limited home service contract, it will address major service issues like structural, systems, and appliance failures that may occur after the initial factory warranty has expired. There is a $100 deductible for each covered item for which you will be responsible. Service issues for these types of items in years 2 through 7 of home ownership should be addressed by calling 1-888-759-3915. We are dedicated to homeowner satisfaction and you can be assured that you will get what you paid for. If service is required, you will get service. If something on your written contract is not provided, we will make things right. If, after all possible actions are taken, there are still unresolved problems, call our homeowner hotline. The phone number is listed at the bottom of your video script. Our goal is to assure your purchase is a satisfying experience. During closing, you will sign an arbitration agreement. If, by some circumstance, we are unable to resolve a dispute concerning the purchase of your home, it will be resolved through the process of arbitration. This is a quick and cost-effective method of fairly resolving disputes. 
An unbiased panel of experts with the authority of the court will hear both sides of a matter and issue a binding and final judgment. The entire process is much faster, so your expenses, frustration, and loss of time are much less than traditional methods. Arbitration is rarely used by our customers, but it is comforting to know the process is available. An owner's packet is shipped with your new home and is most often located in the kitchen drawer. Please make a note of the important documents it contains. The warranty registration card must be completed and sent today to register your warranty with the manufacturer. The factory warranty explains warranty coverage. Your seven-year extended service contract information will be sent in a separate pack within 60 days. The insulation notice specifies how the home is insulated. The installation manual provides important information concerning how the home is to be installed. The satisfaction checklist will be used to address all cosmetic factory warranty service prior to move in. The owner's package may contain other warranties and important documents depending on the appliances and options purchased. In a moment, you will sign and date the video script and hand it to the retail business manager. This tells us that you have seen the video and understand its contents. Again, we wish to thank you for selecting one of our fine homes. We hope the preceding information helps you more fully understand the construction process and sincerely wish for you the experience of many satisfying years in your new home.